So what we're doing here is putting cells back into the liver usually and they make insulin in a very controlled way, exactly the way the body would normally do so. And that by, by that means the patients have very stable sugar control and many can come completely off insulin for periods of time. To have an experience of 500 of these at one place is something we're extremely proud of. It's a reflection of an amazing team. Jason has just received a brand new type of transplant where instead of putting the cells in the liver, we put them in the lining of the stomach. And the expert uh, radiological team is involved in doing this very simple procedure. It takes about 15, 20 minutes, and then we just simply trip the cells in. So these are not stem cells. These are uh, islets of Langerhans that are found within normal individuals that don't have diabetes. And these come from organ donors from right across the country. Today, we, we can pretty much guarantee that when we get a pancreas, most of the time we'll be able to transplant with large numbers of islets. We couldn't do that at the beginning. So the process has got a lot better. For the last 21 years, I've been diabetic. So I, it's kind of hard for me to know what normal is anymore. The last time uh, my sugars went low, like the, the probably in the last year here, is I broke my collar but doing laundry. So it was kind of a, a, a wake up call. Probably about three or four weeks after the first transplant, I can feel my lows. And uh, I'm happy with that. I can feel my, my sugar is dropping now. If I don't have to take insulin, that's a bonus.